Hello, everybody. Once again, I am Robert, and this is Corvette World Dallas, and I've got a green beauty here. This is a Lime Rock Green Premier Edition Stingray Convertible 2014. So C7 started, kicked off in 2014, and they had a handful of what they call Premier Editions. They had 500 coupes and 550 convertibles. All the coupes were Laguna Blue with manual transmissions with the brownstone interior, and all the Premier Edition convertibles were Lime Rock Green and automatic with the brownstone interior and Kalahari top. The Premier Editions also came standard with the upgraded, what they call Chrome Torque Directional Wheels. It's a nice little $3,600 upgrade. Z51, Magnetic Ride. They had pretty much, they all came as 3LT, MPP exhaust, and the spoiler. In 2014, MPP exhaust was not standard in Z51s yet, but all the Premier Editions had them. And Lime Rock Green ended up being a one-year color. There was a grand total of 1,577 of them total. And of course, 550 of them were the Premier Edition convertibles. Like all C7 convertibles, of course, you got the partition here and it's your trunk space. If you put the top up, you can drop partition and get an extra 30% more space. Coming to the interior, all the Premier Editions have the brownstone interior. The brownstone was very exotic for a time. It really showed, was showing off Chevrolet's step up in quality and interior first vet to feature the Napa premium leather. And this particular interior also has the suede seat inserts as a standard, suede armrests on the door panels, accents on the dash and sides of the door panels, as well as the center console. But you still retain a leather steering wheel with the Kalahari stitching throughout. Of course, coming to the engine, of course, we have our venerable LT1 here with 6.2 uh, liter, 460 horsepower, magnetic ride, of course, being standard on the Premier Editions, dry sump oil. And uh, of course, at the time, 460 horse, you know, that was a big deal, a big step up for, again, you know, they keep getting more powerful each generation. So they're like, hey, we're up to 460 now, up from 430 from the LS3. So it was really, really exciting time. I know because I was working at Chevrolet and the first C7 I ever laid eyes on person was a Premier Edition. It arrived at the dealer, and I remember the first time I sat in, and I was like, wow, just wow. So I've always had a special place in my heart with this color and this interior combination. This beauty here has 38,900 miles, and we got it priced at 49995 It is number 124 of, they're all numbered, all the Premier Edition number 124 of the 550 produced. There's a commemorative plaque plate in the uh, center stack just beyond the shifter. And of course, they're all bin number ordered as well. If you are interested in this collectible or any other Corvette in our inventory, please see our contact information up here in the corner and down in the description below. Once again, I am Robert. This is Corvette World. I want to thank you all for watching. Please hit the thumbs up if you liked the video, subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one.